Hi guys, it's Riley here, and I am back again with a brand new video for you all. I'm really excited about today's video because it is my current regression favorites. I'm going to show you all of my current favorites that have to do with my age regression, and yeah, it's going to be really super fun, so let's get started. First category is my first favorite passy is this pentacle passy that I got from it used to be Fox's Little Universe but now I think it's Rook's Supply Depot. I love it a lot. They sent it to me disassembled so I could put the good teat on it which I love and it's just so pretty and silvery and it's got a little pentacle on it because if you didn't know I'm a witchy baby and yeah so this is just the perfect passy for me. These next two I also replaced the nipple in as I I do with literally every passy I own but it is this blue sparkly and clear and the green sparkly and clear I love the sparkly clear shields I love the sparkly purple and the sparkly gold they were my favorite a while ago but I am currently loving the blue and the green I think they're so cute I actually have a modded passy for this favorites video too and it is this little one it has a little moon on it and it has a little birdie sitting on the moon and it's got a clear ma'am shield and it also glows in the dark, which is super cute. So if I'm not in the mood for one of my blue glow-in-the-dark passies, I grab this one. Now on to onesies, the thing you all want to know about. My first favorite onesie is this rainy days onesie. It's so cute. It's got a bunch of little critters. It's green, but I don't know if you can see, but it's kind of like polka dotted, which is really cute. And it's got all these critters playing in the rain, and I absolutely love it because I love rainy days. Next up is this primary tutu onesie. It's got a little skirt on it, but it's a full onesie still, and it's so cute, and it's so primary, and I love it because if I'm feeling more girly, I can wear it and be the cutest little primary princess that you ever saw. I love it a lot. It's super cute and I just even just looking at it makes me so happy. Oh my gosh, it's great. My next favorite onesie is my daddy's little boy one from Little Tude. It's so cute. I love the metal snaps on it and it's just it's adorable and I love how they offer one for the little boys that have daddies. They also have a mommy's little girl one which is also super cute. It just doesn't apply to me and if you are a little boy with a daddy you can snag yourself this onesie and use the code Riley to get 15% off at LittleTude.com. The link to them is down below if you are interested. Now on to diapers. The first favorite in my diaper category isn't technically a diaper but it's a diaper product and that is these plastic pants as you can see there is some color worn off onto them and that is because the dotty diaper company super boompas like to bleed color if you're using them it'll bleed color onto your onesies and that's not fun but I still have a bunch of those diapers left and I'm not just gonna not use them so I figured I would pick up a pair of cheap plastic pants from eBay and that is what I did they are just regular plastic pants and obviously you can see the color has worn off of the super boompas but wearing this not only protects against the color bleeding onto your onesie but it also protects from leaking onto like furniture and stuff so these these are great these are useful highly recommend I, they were less than ten dollars really reasonably priced and they fit me good so they make them for fat people too. <laughs> My next favorite is an actual diaper. I just recently did a review on this diaper and I have been loving wearing them recently. They're super soft, they're super comfortable, and it is the DC Idol. I just think the baby blue color is so sweet and I love the way that the plastic feels. If you wanna see why I love them completely, you can go watch the video on my review of them. And then at last four diapers, there are actually some pull-ups and it is these 
Assurance underwear from Walmart. These are the women's ones just because, you know, trans and anatomy and you kind of have to go by anatomy with these things. But I got these pull-ups. They're cute and purple and I think they're perfect for when I don't want to like fully regress or I don't want to like commit to wearing and using a diaper. I feel like these are a really good solution and they stretch so much. I'm not totally sure on the capacity of these because I don't usually use them but I feel like they'd probably hold a wedding or so but they're super cute they're stretchy they're comfortable and they're great if you want to wear a onesie but not wear a full dip now on to toys I have been loving recently my top favorite toy currently are Barbies. I had Barbies a lot as a bio kid so it reminds me of my bio childhood and I also really love that this one is one of the jointed Barbies which makes everything so good. I have five Barbies total. I have four girls and a boy and I have in the varying body types and everything and they all got super cute clothes and they're just super fun to play with and play pretend and set up and you can do like a mini photo shoot with them. Them, it's really great. I highly recommend that y'all get yourselves a Barbie. And Barbies are not just for little girls, okay? Little boys can play with Barbies too. And non-binary little people. My next toy favorite is actually sitting over here in this chair. Let me grab him. You've seen him before. This is my giant bear salsa. I got salsa from Goodwill for literally only $10. It was a wonderful deal. I couldn't have left the store without him. He's cute. He's wearing a onesie as well and a passy with the passy clip. And he is the most cuddly big thing ever. So when I regress to really little like baby-ish. I love just rolling around with him on the bed and it's super fun. And you can play peekaboo with him too because you can move his paws up and down and it's so fun. I love playing with you salsa. Mwah. Now on to my very last category for the favorites and that is shows that I have been loving recently. The first show I've really been loving is Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood for when I'm in a smaller headspace. It's a spinoff of Mr. Rogers because Daniel Tiger was a character in the Mr. Rogers show and I watched Mr. Rogers as a bio kid so I think it's super fun that now there's a new show Daniel Tiger that is kind of along the same lines. It is animated but it is so so cute and it's so fun to watch and I learn a lot of stuff when I watch it and it's just really 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 good. <laughs> the next show that I have been loving I actually never watched is the bio kid because I wasn't allowed to and daddy was like you gotta watch it Bubba so I decided to start watching it and that is Spongebob. I'm sure most of you have already watched Spongebob and seen Spongebob but I heckin love Spongebob. It's so funny I'm finally getting all of the like jokes and memes that came out of it and it's a really good kid show especially for when you're in like an older regress state. So Spongebob is good and I am slowly working my way through the series. That is all. Thank you guys so 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 much for watching. You can subscribe down below if you want to see more videos on age regression from me and I also have a main channel and a vlog channel that I post on about weekly so if you want to see even more content from me you can follow those links down in the description to take you to those channels. You can follow me on my social media if you want on Instagram it's Riley's Little Space and Crayons and Pencils but to be honest I'm not really using those Instagrams anymore. I'm not using a lot of my regression social media right now. I'm finding that I'm more regressing personally and I'm not sharing as much but I'm still sharing on YouTube because I love you guys and YouTube is such a fun platform for me to share stuff on and the other ones kind of feel like a chore sometimes. So I'm not always active on those social medias but if you still want to follow me on there you can. Alright I love you guys a whole heck of not and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.